Okay, in this tutorial I want to show you how to use some basic editing tools. The editing tools are here, right here. I'm going to show you how to use the selection tool, the envelope tool, and the uh, and the time shift tool. Okay? To do that, let's imagine I am going to edit a music file which I'm going to use in a when I use in a podcast. So I click here on project and I go to import out audio. I click there and I choose the file I want to edit. I'm going to choose this one over here. Okay? And as you will see, this music file is way too large for um, uh, the podcast I want to I want to uh, use it. So what I'm going to do first is to choose the area. I went to the lid soup, sorry, I'm going to click here on selection, that's what I have to do, so click right here, selection, and I'm, I'm going to sort of delete this, uh, all this, right, so I drag my mouse all over the area, I want to delete, so I can click here, the scissors, see, very easy, or let me click here and undo, or you can click here on cat, or you can press control uh, X, right, on your keyboard. So I'm going to click here, cat, and I have the segment I want to use. Um, now another uh, important tool you have get to learn how to use is this one over here, the time shift tool, because that's just going to help you slide the tracks to the left or to the right. Let me show you. So see? See? Very easy to do. Okay. Now another um, tool you can use for changing a little bit the volume of, of the track is the envelope tool. See? So what I want to do is that I will click here just in the middle, right? And now I'm gonna click here. Right? See? And I'm gonna do this. I'm gonna click right here and I'm gonna right there. Right there. Perfect. And now I am going to uh, click here and I'm gonna do this and here I'm going to do this right so this is what's gonna happen when I click here on the selection tool first and now I'm gonna test what I did check what I did see it's low very low and the little the volume starts increasing see so um, sounds really good like it nice so this is something you can use, uh, for example, at the beginning of your podcast and the same audio, uh, the same segment at the end of your podcast. See, See? it it doesn't sound really really uh, good here, so I'm gonna edit it a little bit more. So I'm gonna click here on the envelope. Sorry, first I have to <laughs> stop the file uh, so uh, I click here again on envelope and I'm going to click here see and I'm going to do this and I think it's now it's going to sound better I'm going to place it here so we won't have to listen to the whole thing again see now it sounds better okay and you can keep it, if you don't like it, because the sound still sounds like strange there, you can click here again, and you can click here, and see, and make it smaller, smaller, and now the sound is going to be way much better. See? Decreases there, decreases. Great, way much better. So you can play a little bit with this, right? Especially the, the envelope tool, because the selection tool is to... Uh, it, in this case to choose a certain area from the segment you want to change, you want to cut. Uh, this one over here is to uh, move or, sh or slide your um, uh, track to the right or to the left, but this one is basically to fade in, fade out your uh, music file. Okay, So uh, at the very beginning it, it's like, oops, you know, uh, clicking in the right parts of the uh, audio file to fade in or fade out, but the more uh, you practice, the better you will get I mean, doing this. So, um, okay, so my audio file is ready, okay, 
and what I'm gonna do is first I'm gonna check here preferences and I'm gonna make sure that the quality here that it is either uh, 32 or 64 I'm gonna choose uh, 32 okay it's got to do with the compression and so I'm gonna click here on OK and now I am going to do this ex export as mp3 and I'm gonna call it uh, my pod uh, what jingle to put it some way and I'm gonna save it great and it's let me check it's gotta be somewhere here on my PC and it's here my pod jingle okay let's check here I know see sounds really good right yeah okay and that's it I want to show you uh, how to use effect um, especially amplifier amp the amplify uh, the um, uh, normalize and uh, echo okay and also fade in fade out that's another way to you know to edit your music file so um, what I want to do is the following I am going to record something here whatever so uh, hi this is Miguel and I'm showing people from the podcasting session uh, how to edit their podcasts so when I listen to it, so uh, hi, this is Miguel, and I'm showing people from the podcasting session uh, how to edit there. Okay, so let's say I want to uh, work a little bit on the quality of the sound. So I'm gonna click here, right, and I'm gonna click here on Effect, and I'm going to click on Normalize, and I would click here on OK. I won't, uh, I won't do anything else, just on OK. So, uh, hi, this is Miguel, and I'm showing people from the podcasting session uh, how to edit their podcast. So, the sound is a little bit better, okay? I'm going to click here on Undo Normalize. Uh, you can also, if you feel the sound is way too low, you can clear here, click here on Effect and choose Amplify. And just click on OK. So, uh, hi, this is Miguel, and I'm showing people from the podcasting session uh, how to... See, it doesn't so sound that low. I'm going to show you again. See, listen, this is the, the uh, first, uh, record my, my first uh, recording, right? The first version, to put it some way. So, uh, hi, this is Miguel, and I'm showing people from the... It sounds a bit low because it's mono, okay? It's not uh, stereo. So, I'm going to click on effect to amplify it listen again so uh, hi this is Miguel and I'm showing people from the podcasting session uh, see so the the sound sound is is better right it doesn't sound that low um, uh, what if you want to work a little bit say for your podcasts and you want to give it a special effect to your audio file uh, one that I use quite a lot especially at the beginning at the end of the program is the uh, uh, echo okay so I'm gonna click here. I'm gonna click here on echo. You can preview if you want to. So uh, hi, so, this is Miguel. Uh, hi, and this is Miguel. I'm showing hi, people Miguel. from the podcasting session uh, how to edit there. Okay. So I'm gonna click on OK. So uh, hi, this is Miguel. Hi, this is Miguel. I'm showing people from the podcast. What I do also, you know, to change a little bit the my voice, so it is not the same voice I do this select again the the segment I want to edit and I click here on um, where is it wait a little bit I'm gonna tell in a minute where it, where it is here change pitch so I play here a little bit let's see so uh, hi so, this is uh, Miguel hi, and this is Miguel. I'm showing hi, people Miguel. from the podcasting session, session. Uh, session. how to edit there no so 
that's not what I want to do. I want to click here again on change pitch and I'm going to choose up down. Let's see what happens. So, uh, hi, this is Miguel, and I'm showing people from the podcast session uh, how to edit. There. Nothing happens. So, I'm going to click here at choose F. So, uh, hi, this is Miguel, and I'm showing people from the podcast session how to it's not a bit strange. Uh, let me choose this one over here. So, uh, hi, this so, uh, is Miguel, hi, and this is Miguel. I'm showing hi, people from the podcast session uh, how to edit. There. So what you can do is play a little, uh, around a little bit with this change page, and your voice is going to sound different, and you can also, you know, uh, add it to, uh, for example, to say the name of your program, of the podcast, if it is a radio project. So you can play a little bit with this. I, I, I always do that. So. Um, okay, so... Uh, so, uh, hi, so this is uh, Miguel. Okay, so that's uh, my uh, recording. And, uh, um, my, uh, using the echo uh, effect. Now, what I want to show you is um, how to use uh, the um, also fade in, fade out. Uh, previously, the previous uh, uh, tutorial, I was showing you that you can use the, use the envelope to work a little bit on changing the, the volume. Uh, the fade in works like this, fade in, fade out. So if I'm going to choose that uh, s segment again from my track and I'm going to choose here fade in see see what happens so, uh, hi see volume increases if I do the opposite here I'm going to choose fade out see what's going to happen how to edit there. see so uh, the audio uh, the audio uh, um, decreases right it's quite the opposite so uh, that's what I uh, what you can use uh, for your podcast uh, what I generally use uh, effect amplify you can decide what what to use uh, to change to uh, improve the quality of your audio so you can use um, amplify you can use the echo you can use fade in fade out uh, you can use uh, also change page and normalize so you just um, play a little bit with those effects and see which ones you like and if the uh, quality of your audio, audio file of, of your track improves okay and uh, don't forget to uh, learn how to use this uh, editing tools and that's it what I want to do now is um, add music to my podcast so here's my recording but before I add music I want to do the following I'm going to uh, do this I want to first normalize at the normalize effect okay and I'm also going to I'm also going to amplify it great so let's see. so uh, hi this is Miguel and I'm showing people from the podcasting session great sounds good it doesn't have to be perfect right at, at least the sound quality is okay it doesn't sound that bad okay and that's important for our podcast. Now, what I want to do is to add music to this um, segment, uh, to this podcast. So, what I'm going to do is that I will click here on Project, then I will click on Import Audio, and I'm going to choose uh, this, my pod jingle. This is the one I recorded in uh, the first tutorial, you know, when I was showing you how to use the edit, the edit tools. Uh, so, click here and okay this is the jingle and this is my recording so what I'm gonna do is that I will click this the selection tool I'm gonna click here on the um, time shift tool and I'm going to place sit here and let's see what happens I want to listen to see what happens So, uh, hi, this is Miguel, and mm, sounds okay. I think I'm gonna do this. Let me see. So, okay, what I'm gonna do is that I will add here 
a fade in okay let's see what happens now so uh, hi this is Miguel and I'm showing people from the point I'm gonna do this again a little bit until it, it sounds right for me so uh, hi this is Miguel and I'm showing people from the podcasting session great so I'm gonna cat this part over here cat okay and I'm going to add the same sound at the end so I click again here on project audio file my pot jingle okay and now what I'm gonna do is that I will drag this at the very end like there and let's see how it sounds there podcasts I'm gonna do this I'm gonna drag it here so it's gonna sound great now oops selection tool how to edit their podcasts okay what I'm gonna do here there is this bit over here and when I click on fade out okay now let's see what happens now So, uh, hi, this is Miguel, and I'm showing people from the podcasting session uh, how to edit their podcasts. Sounds good. What I'm going to do is that I will do this better. Okay. And I think the thing is going to sound way much better. This podcast is going to sound way so, much uh, better. So, hi, this is Miguel, and I'm showing people from the podcasting session uh, how to edit their podcasts right so I like it so what I'm gonna do is that I will check once again here preference preferences I'm gonna choose just 32 great uh, okay and I'm gonna click here on export as mp3 yep no problem and I'm gonna click here I'm gonna click here my pod guest save right and now what I'm going to do is that I will check So, uh, hi, this is Miguel, and I'm showing people from the podcasting session uh, how to edit their podcasts. And that's it.